What is going on guys? Grave here today. I'd like to talk about selling crowns in the Elder Scrolls Online at a trader. This has been a discussion in the community for a long time now and a lot of people would like to see some changes when it comes to selling crowns in game. Some people think it should be taken out completely and some people think there needs to be a safer way of doing this because you're kind of doing it at your own discretion. Now if you do get ripped off for your gold or you do get ripped off for your crowns of course you can file a ticket with Zoss. They will give you your uh, gold or crowns back but they do say you're doing it at your own discretion. They're only going to give you your items back one time. So kind of, you know, a slap on the wrist to learn your lesson, that kind of thing. Now I've known people that have been scammed several times and always get their items back, but it is still a bit of a risk as we all know. And a lot of people, like I said, have uh, suggested that we be able to sell these crowns at a trader. And I think if Zoss is going to continue to allow people to sell crowns in game, it would be nice if we did have some way to do it. Now I'm not quite sure exactly how everybody in the community feels about this but just kind of my thoughts on it if we did have a central hub not necessarily a guild trader because i think clogging up the guild trader with crowns is going to take up a lot of spaces and there's going to be less items out there for sale so i think having a central hub in one zone where there's an npc that sells crowns so if you need to buy something with uh, you know gold and you want to buy crowns to buy that item um, then you can go into that central hub purchase those crowns with your gold and then go into the store and buy what you want. I think that should be the way it is handled. The UI could be set up just like a guild trader, but it would just be a, like I said, a central hub where you could purchase crowns from other players in game that are selling them, but you're buying them from that NPC just like a guild trader would be set up. That way it would be safer for everyone. It would be safer for the person selling crowns. It would be safer for the person you know buying the crowns with their gold. And I also think it would maybe help with the price uh, you know, of per crown for gold because right now of course on console the price really hasn't changed at least on playstation much over the years most of the time you can find uh, crowns for anywhere from 70 gold to 150 gold per but i do know like on pc that it is a lot different i mean most of the time everyone i see on pc is saying three four five hundred all the way up to a thousand uh you know gold per crown which gets to be very very expensive and i do know the economy is different you know uh, pc players seem to make a lot more gold for things in the traders and prices are a lot higher but overall i think if there was some competition with the prices of the crowns that the crown prices themselves may go down enough to where you know it's going to allow people that may not have tons of gold to still be able to buy them now i do understand that it might hurt crown prices in general you know if it starts to be where people are just competing for prices and it gets down to let's say 70 uh you know gold per crown or cheaper it might not really be worth selling your crown. So it might allow or not right really make, I guess, for less crown sellers in general. People aren't going to go out and have crown sales and spend on, you know, things they want and then turn around and sell their crowns for absolutely dirt cheap. They'll just probably keep them. So I think there probably needs to be some type of system where it sets a base price and a maximum price. And then you have to price your crowns within that, you know, kind of zone. So leave me a comment, guys. What do you think? Would you like to see this kind of option, a central hub where you can buy and sell crowns in the Elder Scrolls Online? Would this make it easier for you where you're not having to go out and buy them in the open world or from guild members? That's what I always do. I always buy from guild members that I trust. That way, you know, you know you're not going to get ripped off. And I'm fine with that system, but I do know a lot of people in the community have talked about wanting something different. And I just kind of want to make a video talk, uh, kind of touching on it, letting, you know, kind of letting you guys know what I think about it and also for you guys to let me know what you think about it. Anyway, of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.